There are different kinds of women and there are different kinds of men. Don't think that you are inferior in any way because you are women. You have a lot of stuff going for you because you are a woman. So I think that just go ahead and do it. I'm Marekarina, I'm from Osango and I'm the founding partner of, of Osango, which is an API and platform economy company. On a daily basis, I train a lot of folks in, in different kinds of organizations, public sector and private sector, and also a lot of individuals who are kind of joining in, in all sorts of recruitment and other training programs and universities, and they actually are looking for roles in API and data space. I have explained it always as, as kind of a interface of business and technology. So APIs are small pieces of code related things, but actually they help people integrate data and functionality together. And actually I had to explain this once for my then, I think he was three or four years old son, because we got pizza delivery at home when he was small. And, and then he didn't see me be, give any money to the pizza guy. I only took the pizzas from the guy and shut the door. And he was very confused because he had just made up his mind that every time somebody, you know, Get, gives you something or you buy something from a store, you have to give money to them. And this was very confusing. And then he started asking why, why, why he was in that age. And I had to explain him the whole banking system and online stores and how the money is transferred via, you know, transfers between from the website where we order the pizza to uh, via payment API to the, <laughs> to the bank and everything else. Adopting APIs is hugely about the culture and the ways of working and the ways of communicating. And that is usually the result of starting to do APIs that actually your way of working and communicating with each other in the company is actually, and outside the company, is going to change whether you want it or not. I believe that there's huge need to have women, men, young, old, and, and different cultures in the teams, but also we should mind that it's not only the IT specialists and the software developers that need to be in the teams. There is actually a good research about this uh, that says that if you have marketers and software engineers talking to each other and within the same culture, then that actually promotes the creation of great APIs. API related vendors, especially the ones who have been in the field like a lot of years, they have a huge transformation in their hands right now, organizationally, product-wise, technology-wise, and they are. Some of them are already there and going strong. Some, some are not, but that is due to the technology changes. Because like APIs used to be a minority thing, <laughs> you know, that you could just ignore them, or, or you you could do whatever software, and you might have APIs there. But actually, right now, everything is becoming APIs. Now that the Women in APIs program has been running, it has actually evolved into connections, more kind of natural connections in doing cooperation uh, between men and women and, and working as colleagues. And for example, now we have this API collective. And I think that it might not have happened without the Women in APIs initiative. <laughs>